What if I told you that I've solved the biggest mystery on Hermitcraft? Well, that's exactly what I've done. I know the exact coordinates of a mycelium resistance base. In today's video, I'm going to explain why these are the correct coordinates. Before I get started, I want to warn you that this will spoil the mystery. If you do not want it ruined, click off this video now. Please remember that this is all for fun. I don't want to start a war with my fanbase. If you are still here, let's go. A few days ago, I made a similar video without exposing the real coordinates because I didn't know them yet. If you have not seen that yet, go watch it and come back to this. As you remember, I said that Green built the decoy and Impulse made the real base, but a commenter on the video showed that Impulse's time lapse did happen in the location of the decoy. If we take a look at this image, he found the spot, and you can see that there are the same bedrock formation, so he definitely found the correct spot. Meaning Green's time lapse wasn't the real base. And as you remember, I found where Green's place was. Well, I now have even more proof that I had the correct location for Green's time lapse. As you can see in this image, the bedrock formations with glass over them line up with the bedrock we see in Green's video. Now let's pay attention to the mob spawner. Look at the cave next to it. The rock formations are identical. This is even more proof that this is the correct spot. Now for the location. This is 50 blocks away from the decoy base at the cords of X25 Z112. The mycelium resistance has been hiding in plain sight for weeks. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do not go screaming chords at your favorite hermit. This is purely for fun and not supposed to start a war within fans. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash that like button, comment down below, and subscribe. Until next time, I'm out. Peace!